Congratulations. Thank you very much. How happy are you about this award? Um, incredibly happy. I so wish my, my team could be with me right now because um, it's uh, definitely uh, not my doing. Um, yeah. So what can you tell us about your restaurant because you know, it's off the map? Uh, so we have a small 20-seater um, restaurant on the west coast of South Africa, um, located in an old fisherman's cottage. Um, we're a team of six that do everything, um, cooking and serving. And uh, um, my colleagues are all born and raised in the village where our restaurant is, with no formal food background. Um, so incredibly proud of them um, for what they've achieved. And yeah, it's such an amazing journey to, to learn from them and to grow together. And, um, yeah, too many more years to come. So what should diners expect from your restaurant? We do a small tasting menu um, of regional produce, um, mostly seafood, and then enhanced by uh, some wild herbs, seaweeds, succulents that we pick around the village. So a very seasonal menu um, in which we try to capture the genius Loki of um, Butternoster, um, the little village uh, which is situated in a very a uh, special plant kingdom called Feinbos. Um and that's what we aim to share with guests. Because it's off the map, how do you get there from maybe Cape Town? Yeah, about two and a half hours drive from Cape Town, uh, up north, um, and then yeah, we're, we're on the on the Friedenberg Peninsula, which is a little uh, outcrop um, on the west, west coast. And what are you going to do when you go back to your restaurant now that you have this award? <laughs> Um, I think we're going to start our shift on Thursday with a glass of champagne or, or local sparkling wine. Yeah, <laughs> that makes sense. Thank you very much.